How to fix sorry couldn't find username Snapchat problem. Any day you face a problem like this, do not worry as we have got the perfect solution for this. First of all, you need to check whether you are connected to a stable internet connection or not. It may be a Wi-Fi connection or it may be a data connection as well. And after you check whether you are connected to a stable internet connection or not, you need to go to the option of the settings. You can go to the option of settings by directly searching the settings or the search code key is tapping on the settings out here. And after you tap on the settings out here, you can see the interface of settings on your very device. Now in the search option, you have to search apps there. After you search apps there, you can see the list of the apps that you have in your very mobile device and the various kind of functions that are on your mobile device. So after you search apps there, you have to wait for a while. Sometimes the very device can be lagging. That may be the various kind of problems that is within your device. It may be a storage problem or anything like that. Now you have to tap on the option of the apps. And after you tap on the option of the apps, you can see the next options like this. Now after you see the next options like this, you have to wait for a while. You can see the various kind of applications that are on on your mobile device. Now you can scroll down until you find the option of Snapchat or the shortcut technique is you can tap here Snapchat and after you tap Snapchat here, you can find the Snapchat there. And then you have to tap on Snapchat. After you tap on the Snapchat, you have to wait for a while until an interface like this appears. Now you have to go to the option of notification. After tapping on the option of notification, you have to check whether allow notification has been enabled or not and whether allow sound and vibration has been enabled or not. After that, you have to go back again. After going back, you have to go to the option of the permissions and you have to check whether permission has been provided to camera, contacts, location, microphone, nearby devices, notifications, phone, photos and videos or not. After that, you have to go back again. After going back, you have to go to the option of storage and tap on the option of storage. And if there is any cache, you have to clear down the cache. Otherwise, you have to go back again. After going back, you have to go to the option of app details in store and tap on the option of app details in store. This way, your very option and your very application will be open in the Google Play Store. And if any update op option is available, level there you need to update your application right there you have to tap on the option of update and this way your application will be updated and a problem will be solved thank you for watching our video and if you like it do not forget to subscribe our channel